Today I found some brand new leaks and concepts of Adopt Me's brand new update and it is the Valentine's update from Salami. So let's go, let's get straight into this. We've got Remy for this video, so let's go. Let's jump right and jump down to the main center. Oh no! Ah! Oh, we're okay. Remy luck. <laughs> Brett Slam, we were in a video from Avocado Play. Shout out to her, and let's take a look at what she has thought could come into the game. So this is the update screen. Happy Valentine's Day, a new love egg, a Cupid Dragon pet, and a heart currency. So this is what it looks like. The love egg looks like it might be Robux. And then this is what the banner looks like, and it's actually really, really awesome. It looks just like an Adopt Me banner. So next up, she chooses parent. I always choose parent. Let me know, do you normally choose parent? or baby when you've joined Adopt Me. But Avocado Place official sent you a valentine and you can send and receive valentines in this update and the more you send and receive, the more money you get and you can earn 100 hearts per valentine's card that you send or receive, which is pretty cool. And the first pet that you can get is the valentine's monkey. Look at that, it's like a pink monkey, it's really cool. There's also the valentine's dog and the valentine's bat, which is so awesome. And there's also the Cupid Dragon that costs 700 Robux, which is pretty expensive, but I think it's going to be a legendary, and it looks so awesome. Just look at that pet. <laughs> I think that's really cool. And for Slummy, I think it on this map, we have some inspiration from their Sweet Street update. And this is an update that literally no one knows about. It's a very secret update. Adopt Me hasn't talked about it ever, and it's not something they've ever done again. We're in a video from Jenny Simmer. Shout out to her. And this video was made back in May of 2018 and it's the Sweet Street update. So here we have the Sweet Street portal and if you headed through this portal you could get to the Sweet Street area. And Prince Lowey, this is what Sweet Street looks like. So you head through the portal and it automatically just teleports you to this area and it actually looks really awesome. So its main colors are like pink, brown and white for like chocolate, uh, lollipops and I guess frosting. <laughs> Red Slummy, if we head through here, look at this. It is just so cool. Like, all of the grass is white. Half the trees have, like, turned into lollipops, and then the trees are actually pink. And I actually think this all looks so, so awesome around a Dot Me's map. Like, imagine all of this just white and pink. Wait, we can actually do that right now. Let's go. Let's turn all of this into pink. Look at that, Prince Lummy. All of the green is now pink. <laughs> but if we just walk around here, we can see how awesome this map is. Is and I would really, really love it if Adopt Me completely changed their map just for the Valentine's update to look like this, like the Sweet Street update. And then the Sweet Street update add four different items. Add the ice tub, which is worth legendaries upon legendaries upon legendaries. It is worth so, so much now. Also the chocolate drop, which looks like a poo, to be honest. <laughs> the normal chocolate, and then I think that's like a chocolate stick or something. Chocolate twist, it was called. Let's actually take a look at Adopt Me's first and only Valentine's update. So, this was all it was. In front of the old nursery, they had two little hearts that sold five different items. The heart hoverboard, which was only recently taken out of the game, and I think Adopt Me took it out of the game to make room for more Valentine's Day updates. So, here's the heart hoverboard, Prince Lowy. For some reason, I have seven. I have no clue why or how I have seven. <laughs> But Red Slowy, this was taken out of the game in Adopt Me's previous update. And I think the reason Adopt Me took it out was so that they have more room in the Robux shop for more Valentine's Day updates. Because Valentine's Day is just around the corner. <laughs> But this is it, Prince Lamy. It actually looks really, really awesome. And it even has like a trail of hearts, which is really cool. Like hearts just randomly appear behind it every now and then. And the items it could get you was the heart cake, which was just a normal slice of cake. The heart rattle. The heart stroller, which looks like this. And a lot of people actually still have that in the game right now. It's really awesome. So that's the heart stroller. Like I said, there was the heart rattle, which was just a heart on a rattle. It was just pretty normal. Then there was also a brand new potion, which is super rare now. <gasps> Look at all those water walking potions. The water walking potions now, that can get you like a good neon giraffe. They are so, so rare. So this girl is super rich in Adopt Me right now. And even all of her food items, like she's got cookies, she's got the dumplings. She's got so many plushies and rattles. Ugh. I'm jealous. Look at how much she has. 
She has so much. And all these items, since they're so old, are just so rare now. And the heart potion will give you like these heart particle effects, a bit like the hoverboard, except they would come off of you. And it was actually really, really cool. So all those items were amazing. And of course, there was also the heart hoverboard. And this is what the update looked like. So most recently, there was the donut shop update that was added, which we can still get in the game now. And then it said, adopt me Valentine's. And that was when adopt me had like 500,000 likes. Now they've got 5 million. It's crazy how much Adopt Me's grown. We were selling we're in a video from Box Quiz. Shout out to them. And they made some really awesome concepts. So here we have three new houses that could be put into the game this Halloween. The chocolate house, which is like really, really awesome. It's, it's got the main house. And then to the side, it's got like a cupcake for a house, which is really cool. Then the sweetie barn, which is like a farm barn, except it's got a massive ice cream scoop. And a, I think it's like a... Um, chocolate lollipop thing. What's that? A cake pop. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's like a cake pop tree. And then there's the frosting palace, which is a palace with so much frosting and so many lollipops on it. <laughs> They're actually really cool. Then we've got three more. The cupcake house, which is literally a cupcake house. The edible house, which is really awesome. And the sweetie house, which is also really awesome. And then there's three more. So nine houses in this update. There's the ice cream shop, which is really awesome. There's the luxury cupcake. So it's like a two-tier cupcake. That's so lit. And then also the Tasty Mansion. So those are all their houses that are added into the game. But the currency could be roses. That was the box quiz's idea. So if you run around the Adopt Me map, you can do a mini game like collecting all of the roses and you have to run around and collect all the roses. A bit like how in last year's Halloween update, we had to go around and chase the Headless Horseman on the motorbike and we had to collect all of the candy corns that were just floating around the map. So this will be very, very similar to that, except we're not chasing a headless horseman and we're not on a motorcycle. <laughs> but there are different things that we can buy in the reward shop. There's a rose bouquet, there's a chocolate box, the Valentine's cup, which you can send to anybody and it can be anonymous if you want. Heart balloons, there's also a picnic. And this is what it looks like when you get it. So it just appears and then two boxy I love your videos <laughs> from question mark, question mark, question mark. Then there's also the heart balloons, a picnic, which is actually really cool. I'm not sure how it would work. Would you like pick a spot in the Adopt Me map to have a picnic? And then it would have like a little animation of like putting out a rug, you sitting down, eating the picnic basket, and then you packing it up and it would be like a five second little animation. I think that'll be really awesome if Adopt Me adds that. Next is the heart bow tie, which will be some pet wear, red heart glasses, which is some more pet wear, a heart car, which actually looks really, really awesome awesome and will look so awesome. So it's like a deliveries truck, like what we had in Adopt Me for the Christmas update. Here's the festive deliveries present truck. <laughs> this is what we got in the Christmas update. And then this is what we could get in the Valentine's Day update. It's actually really cool. And the heart car is actually delivering a ton of roses and hearts. <laughs> Next up is the diamond ring, which we could give to other players or we could wear ourselves or give to our pets to wear. Next up is Cupid's bow, which will work like a grappling hooks, except it would have a different animation, like you would pull it back and then go ping, <laughs> and then it would hook somewhere and it will pull you back. So it was very, very similar to a grappling hook, except like a slightly different concept. Next is a fairy tale carriage, which looks so, so awesome. It's like all blue and got ice around it. I just think it's amazing. And the Valentine's egg. Let's take a look at what pets are in the Valentine's egg. So we can auto hatch this egg and take a look, pet salami. We got the dove pet. That's so, so cute. So the dove is uncommon. It can sit, lay down, beg, handstand, backflip, and dance. And I actually think that the dove is super cute. Next up, if we hatch another one, we get a pug pet, which is so, so cute. There's a little pug. <laughs> I think that is really, really cute pet salami. I love the pug pets so, so much. I've wanted a pug pet for so long at Adopt Me. We got the St. Bernard, which was close to a pug, but I really, really want a pug. <laughs> Next up though, Brett Salami, we have a kitten, which is super, super cute. So it's like a snow cat, except not. It's a little bit different. I just think it looks so cute and it can sit, lay down, bounce, head, stand back, flip and dance. And it's rare, which is really cool. Next up though, Brett Salami, we have the heart bear, which is just a bear. It's got a cute little bow tie and it's got a heart on its belly, which is super cute. And it's ultra rare and it can sit, lay down, beg, break, dance, dance and trick. 
But Pret Salami, we've got the final one, the legendary Pink Dragon! <laughs> the Pink Dragon can sit, lay down, bounce, roll over, backflip, and dance. Pret Salami, if you're excited for the Valentine's Day update, let me know down in the comments below, and I'll see you in the next one. Have the best day ever. Yeah. Peace!